Welcome back. Today we are immersing ourselves in the realm of Powered Virtual Agents, a remarkable Microsoft platform that empowers you to craft sophisticated chatbots and virtual agents without the complexities of coding. Whether you are a newcomer to this field or seeking to enhance your expertise, this initial installment serves as foundational guide, unraveling the essential principles of Power Virtual Agents. So this is the first segment of our tutorial series in which we'll delve into five introductory questions along with their comprehensive answers. As we progress, this comprehensive playlist will encompass a total of 50 questions spanning from beginner to advanced level. By the conclusion of this video, you will possess a robust comprehension of crafting, overseeing and seamlessly incorporating chatbots to elevate yourself and you to elevate the user interaction. So these are the questions, first five questions where I'll be discussing about the answers and how to prepare for that as well. So let us start. What is Power Virtual Agent and what is its primary purpose? So this is what the basic question. What exactly is Power Virtual Agent and why it is important? So Power Virtual Agent is a user friendly platform that empowers you to design and deploy chat boats and virtual agents. Its primary purpose is to simplify the creation of conversational interface for various applications and services. Whether it's a customer support, information retrieval or automating task, Power Virtual Agents has got you covered. So Power Virtual Agent is a Microsoft platform that enables you to build chatbot and virtual agents without delving into intricate coding. So this democratizes the process, making it accessible even to those with minimal programming language. By using a visual interface, you can define conversation flow and triggers and actions and create an interactive experience for the user. So now uh, that we understand the platform purpose, let's get practical. How do you actually create a new chatbot from scratch in Power Virtual Agent? So this is what the next question it will be. Okay. So this is where you will shape your chatbot's conversation flow. You can add triggers to initiate interaction such as user input or system events. Then define action like sending message, asking question and more to build the logic of your chatbot responses. Triggers and actions are pivotal to chatbot functionality. So could you explain? What are these terms like what is triggers and actions in power uh, virtual agent? So this will be the next question. Absolutely triggers are like the start button for a chatbot conversation. They are events that prompt the bot to engage with the user. Triggers can be user input like hello or help or system events triggered by specific conditions. Actions on the other hand are the steps the chatbot takes in response to the trigger. They determine what the bot says or does next. Actions could involve sending message, asking question or making API calls and more. So integrating external system sounds intriguing. How can we connect a chatbot to external services or API? So this is what the next thing. Can you explain how to integrate a power virtual agent with external system or a services? Integrating external systems is where the magic happens. To achieve this, we use custom API. In power virtual agent, you can use the HTTP action to make an API call. Simply provide the API endpoint, request method, headers, and any necessary parameters. This enables your chatbot to exchange data with external systems, enhancing its capability and providing users with accurate information. So, entities seem important. So, what role do the play, do the entities play in the chatbot effectiveness? So, what is the importance of entities? 
entities are like puzzle pieces that help the chatbot understand user intent better they extract specific information from user input such as dates numbers or names by using entities you can refine the chatbot's responses and provide more tailored interactions for instance when a user mentions a date the date entity can extract the date for further processing enabling the chatbot to respond accurately so you can see that i have given the answers for that as well so you can see that i have given the specific answer i have given the interviewer expectations as well so what is the expectation of the interviewer and what are the answer you can give and what are the skills required for this like basic understanding everything okay so i'll be uh, sharing this link the document link in the in the description okay and uh, what you can do is you can view this document so what i'm planning is i'll be uh, collecting at least 50 questions together okay and uh, for every question for every five five questions set of five questions i'll be releasing a video and also i'll be uh, giving the link to view this document okay so i request you all to subscribe to the channel before viewing this document because of course if you try to view the document it will take you to subscribe the channel okay because i have spent a lot of time in order to craft this um questions so it will be great if you subscribe to the channel to uh, be on track to be on track so that what you can do is whenever i release a new interview questions you can just go through that so and there you have it your beginners guide to power visual agent we have covered the essentials from understanding the platform's purpose to creating chatbot using triggers and action integrating external system and leveraging entities with this foundation you are ready to dive deeper into the world of chatbot development so thanks for joining us today and stay tuned for more exciting tech insights in, on my channel don't forget to like subscribe and hit the notification bell to stay updated Take care. Bye-bye.